Alright, hello, hello. Welcome once again, my Boulder Shops YouTube reviews. Yeah, mate. With Rock Rider and Marcus. Marcus. Yes. Mate, we're pumping them out. We are, we what, are. Nearly two a week now. Yeah, yeah, we like doing these things. We're coming to the end of the week, so it's always good, it's always mate, good. Mate, I know you're excited. I am. I'm always <laughs> excited. When aren't I excited? But uh, to be honest, today I am definitely excited because we do have the uh, fourth of the uh, the collection. What was it? The, the top Marquez collection. Not my, not my collection, not Marcus's collection. Marcus, you've got a collection. Yeah, no, no, that's, that's the other right, one. Right, not no, no, this is the Marquez collection. From Tullabarden. Yes. Right? Tullabarden, yes. Scottish whiskey. Yep, yeah. so this is the uh, mm. Murray, uh, named after Sir William Murray, or commonly known in Australia as the Murray. Ah, oh, Jim Murray. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, right, nah, Murray, this is uh, actually finishing a uh, masala cask. Right. So, um, you know. I'm very excited to... Can I do the honours and mate, just crack the thing over guess, while, you're, while, while you're talking? But about while you're doing, I will bring the attention, packaging. yeah, that's it, to our uh, viewers. And this box is phenomenal. Mm. Um, it's got this lovely pattern here uh, all around the box. Yeah, it's a beautiful it's, box. This box is, is, is really amazing. It's, it's a piece mm. of art. Um, so, you know, mm. it definitely would look good in someone's uh, shelf. We'll uh, look it on my it, shelf. Oh, yeah, do if, you want, if it makes it. <laughs> uh, but, you know, really, really nice box. Awesome. I'll just put that here. It is very honest. impressive. And actually, it's a really lovely bottle. I love the purple colour. Yeah. Um, and, it, and it's quite a dark looking whiskey, mm. I must say. And I see, oh, there's a bit of stuff floating around inside yeah. it, like a, almost a little bit cloudy, which tells me that what it's it tell not chill filtered. Yes, there you go. So for the whiskey nerds out there. Oh, look at that beautiful, um, would you say like a wood cork top? Yeah. Very impressive yeah. packaging. Yeah, wooden cork It's top. ridiculous. I mean, we're selling this for 115 bucks. Seems too cheap to me. And there's not many bottles left in Australia, right? Oh, the mail is there's only 50 cases available in, in Australia, Australia, right? That's now, um, I know that Tullabarden, oh my God, smell that. It's like it's wafting over my nose, smell that. <laughs> Mm. That is pretty impressive, mm. right? Let's put this over to one yeah. side yeah, right. so the bottle can take um, a part of plastic. So I'll just pour a bit in here, Marcus, and get a little bit of air. Yeah. Um, Thank you. Again, a little bit of a backstory about the brand, I guess, was owned by White and McKay, famous. I'm sorry, I've turned around the white. Right. Owned by famous uh, whiskey house, White and McKay, uh, who did the White Horse label. The White Horse. I know we've got some of the older bottles around. In our collection probably downstairs. Yeah. Um, they That's owned true. it for about uh, from forty nine to, to ninety five, and then closed down Tullabarden. Oh. And then a family looks like a French family. Can't even pronounce it. Picard Vin Spiro Spirito. I'm reading off the cheat sheet. <laughs> <laughs> um, so so what they're saying um, is that um, it, it stayed a family owned business effectively. And uh, we like family-owned businesses That's here right. at my bottle shop. That's right. This being a family-owned business, and uh, I, you know, I'm supporting a lot of family-owned businesses. Yeah. So it's always a bit of that extra quality in the family. Well, you know, uh, right it's a, a business, I think. Yeah, yeah. right. And we've seen it here, haven't we, with um, some of these, you know, these huge multinational corporations. Yeah, Joe, talking to you. Um, you know, the packaging is substandard. Um, yes. The, yeah. Some of the product quality is a little bit dicey, but we certainly see it here. Um, you know, running a, a, an online liquor business, don't we? I mean, yeah. I, I must say, this packaging, this, no, no, no. this is a tough box. Yeah. And, and I know maybe to the YouTubers, you go, stop raving about the packaging, yeah. but yeah. we've got to put this stuff in boxes and send yeah. it to our customers. Right. So right. we don't yeah. want the packaging, we don't want it for our customers either, for the packaging to fall apart. That's right, that's right. And this is something that, you know, it's, it's very, uh, very sturdy. You know, unless you actually bash that, it wouldn't be tearing in the corners and no. whatnot. And so we've had it, haven't we? We've had. <sighs> We too, many times, too, yeah. many times, too many yeah. times. Too many yeah. times. Too many times. So um, it's a big plus. All right, Marcus. Now, sorry for maybe short poured you. Sorry, the lid's already off. I maybe short poured you there, mate. Sorry Jeez. about that. And I know. Actually, I tell you what's what, going on. What I know we only got one bottle, but this is still what is it? Seven hundred mils. Yeah, we still, still a bit in there. It smells amazing. I can tell you that. Um, one thing I know we don't do, well, we haven't done on our reviews, particularly with the whiskey. Um, so we don't have like a water dropper here. We should have our whiskey diluting yeah. dropper, so we can put yeah. some water in the, the whiskey, and we haven't done that. Yeah. Um, right. So we should Next do that. Time. We've got heaps of those Next little whiskey time. diluting droppers. Yeah, yeah. So, um, so right. Marcus, How's the nose come on, mate. Me. Now, now, you've got to tell me yeah. the Italian connection. Come on, 
Oh, no yeah. from Calabria? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, Masala. Look how the brains yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Apparently, um, it's from Sicily, actually. So. Um, Sicilian? Yeah, right, so no? basically, yeah, yeah, it is Sicilian. So, oh, oh, sorry, the, the wine. Uh, yeah. Wine barrel, I guess? Yeah, Masala wine. Masala, masala, masala wine, right? Yeah, Masala wine. You drink wine. that at home? Yeah, oh, I don't, I don't. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so after the, uh, I guess, the uh, first barrel, it goes straight into the Masala wine cask uh, for its finish. Right. So, it's literally two barrels and then into the bottle. So, um, so now let, get, let me get this right. It says distilled in 2006, bottled in 2018, right? Yeah. So making it a 12-year-old whiskey. Yes. Um, so how long do they finish it for then in the masala? It's just, wine? just a year, right at the end. Right, right at the end. Okay. So um, I don't know anything about masala wine. Yeah. <laughs> um, so what do we? What can we expect then? I guess with the finish. Well, I think it's going to be uh, have very uh, very sweet notes. Really? Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, okay, very sweet okay. notes. Okay. But, you know, to be honest, I'm very interested. Mm. Because, um, well, let's, let's, just on the nose yeah. here, I get a big hit of ginger straight away. Mm. I don't know where that's yeah. coming from. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. What do you get? Maybe some berries. Uh, then there's also a bit of nutty or maybe biscuity sweetness mm. to it. So it's not maybe like a chocolate. Um, mm. It's not too sweet mm. like some of the others that we've tried. Mm. It's definitely got a perfume around, like, no, not a perfume, it's got a very, like, when I opened that bottle, it was like, bang, yeah. you know, I, I, I could smell it from over here, yeah. so. Now, um, uh, you know, funnily enough, I just want to uh, bring our viewers to the attention, and also in the official taste notes, it says, pre drink is on the nosing notes, but um, do you, you know get what? the pre I've been mean, dying to ask you this, because I don't really get that. You don't go around sniffing printers ink? Yeah, no, <laughs> in spare time? I don't know. <laughs> I am in the office, but uh, I, you know, I don't really have my head under the printer too often, yeah. so I'm not sure what that smells like. Oh, what do you think? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah. Nope. So, <laughs> don't get printer zinc yeah, at all. Yeah, so no um, printer zinc. Right, right, I've already, list. I've already uh, r rushed a sip of that. I'm sorry, I should have yeah. that. <laughs> That's alright. Cheers, I've already right, like, well, got it into my yeah, mouth. Well, I'll try. You can, you can tell them what you think. Mate, I'll tell you what. Um, that has got... It's... Oh, Swear to God, Ooh. it's a chocolate note to it. Yeah. Um, Ooh, wow. It's like eating, it's like you know what it's like. It's like eating almost like a cherry roll. Mm. Yeah, I get that. A yeah. chocolate with yeah, a bit of cherry, yeah. dark, probably dark. You know, cherry ripes, um, cherry ripes a dark color. Yeah. Dark chocolate. Yeah. Um, wow. Quite a long finish too. What do you think? It Ooh. is. It's. It's. So what percentage is it? Oh, I see what you're saying. The Marquez collection. Yeah, the, nah, collection. Not the Mar collection. Mar 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 Marcus. Marcus's collection. Yeah, 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 yeah. I wish. Uh, let's have a look. Percentage-wise, 46%. 46% is beauty. Um, yeah, but, so quite a, quite a long finish, but there's still, I guess, those um, spicy, and as I said before, there is those sweet notes that do come out. Mm. Not too sweet, but um, no. it is a good, it's a very balanced. Yeah, it's, 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 so, um, it's different. I must yeah. say, it's... You know, it's not a sherry whiskey, yeah, and yeah, it's not yeah, a bourbon yeah, cast. Yeah, it's, 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 yeah. yeah, it's it's a, it's an uh, it's in its own place. Yeah, um, and it's, it's quite a it's a little bit of an oddball color too. Yeah. I would say um, it's a little bit. What would you say, Marcus? I mean, you can see that it's not chill filled because you can see it's a little bit almost cloudy. Yeah, yeah. Um, really there seems to be there seems to be particles yeah, floating yeah, around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's lots of, so, so the this is a genuine yeah. shit, this yeah. is like, no mucking yeah. around, no chill yeah. water in I, I think it is those wine casts that I guess give it mm. that colour. Mm. Um, I wish I knew more, more about wine. masala wine. Yeah, yeah, well if anyone knows a bit more and I guess wants to, knows more about uh, its colour and maybe why now, how, its colour. Well, well, so now, share how far away is Sicily from... Where I'm from, Calabria. Yeah, it's Calabria. Right next door. Right next yeah, door. Yeah, but we don't like them all too much. Ah, okay. <laughs> that's why you don't drink yeah, the Yeah, I wouldn't um, touch the wine. Right, so you don't <laughs> drink the Sicilian Martin Sala wine, yeah. eh? they got to do one uh, in the Calabrian cast next uh, time. Calabrian so I'll, cast. I'll send a note into Talabad and maybe so, that's the next one. Thank you, Talabad. <laughs> Calabrian wine cast finish. Maybe that's the next in the Marquis, Marquez collection, yeah. whatever. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, um, mm. no, nah, look, overall, it's very unique, this. Um, it is a limited edition, again, yes. like yep. a lot of stuff we have here at my bottle shop. Mm. Um, 
So we have it on good authority. There's three three hundred bottles or something, right? Is that right? Three hundred yeah, bottles correct, in correct. Australia. So, so yeah, mm. I think Talabatam once again, you know, they've done mm. a really good job with this. Mm. Um, all the, the bottles in that collection have been, you know, noteworthy. But well, yeah, we actually haven't had them. They did the Chateau Neuf de Pat, which is a French wine, and there's been a couple others, but um, this, unfortunately, this is the first one we got here. But yeah. wacko, and I, I think value yeah. for money, man, amazing. It's great so, price. It's great price. Yeah. So, to be honest, I think once those uh, bottles could fly out the door. I don't think it would be available around for that price too much longer. Yeah, yeah. So if you are interested, I you know you just want to try it. I'd suggest get on it ASAP. Um, mm. And if anybody like we, what we're trying to do is promote um, more people leaving comments. Yeah. Um, you know, Correct. if you're something in the video that we've done that's wrong, mm. you know, the facts aren't straight, or you know about um, a Sicilian masala wine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'd love comments, to know about yeah. it. I'd love to know about it. But um, All you right. know, as always, thank you again for tuning in. Cheers, you know, Marcus. So thank you. Cheers. Right. Great to have the uh, Italian connection. Yeah, of course. And as always, please subscribe to our channel. And uh, hopefully we'll see you next time. Cheers. Thank you.